Hi guys, welcome to Pabli Connect Workshop. So in this video, we will learn how to integrate YouTube and Google Sheet. Our use case is pretty simple. When new video is uploaded in YouTube, it will create a spreadsheet row in Google Sheet. Now YouTube is an online video sharing platform. Actually, you are currently using it. And Google Sheet is your favorite spreadsheet program. So what we are going to do is, we are going to send the data from YouTube to Google Sheet. But there's one minor problem. The integration between YouTube and Google Sheet is somewhat limited. In cases like these, we need to bring a third app to connect them both. So in this video, we will use Pabli Connect to integrate YouTube and Google Sheet. And the best part of using Pabli Connect is, there is no need for coding skills or programming language. It can be done easily. Let me show you on my screen. Okay, so to begin the process, first type pabli.com in your browser pabli.com press enter okay so this is the website of pabli.com here bring your attention to this part called as products then get on to connect at the bottom you will find the option called as connect click this then click on sign in okay so this is the dashboard of pabli connect as you can see, I have an account in Pabli Connect. You can also create your own free account in just two minutes. Here I would like to mention one more thing that Pabli Connect offers a free plan where this integration can be tried out absolutely free. So if you want, you can create your own account right now and set up your own automation. The link is available in the description box. Actually, I would insist that you try this automation with me. It's actually pretty fun. So scroll down and in the connect part, click on access now. Then at the right top corner, you will find a button called as create workflow. Click this. So our dialog box appears in front of you. It is asking you to give a name to this workflow. I'm going to give it as YouTube to Google Sheets. YouTube to Google Sheets. Then click on create. So when you click on create, a window appears in front of you. This is called as the trigger window. Here in the choose app, let's make it as YouTube because we want to send the data from YouTube to Google Sheet. So the trigger app is the YouTube. Now in the choose method, you have two options, new video on the channel and the new comment. Since we want to send the data to Google Sheet when there is a new video on the channel. So let's keep the method as new video on the channel. So now new video on the channel is basically a trigger. So your obvious question is, what is a trigger? Trigger is a if statement. It asks a question, if the condition is met, what should be done? For example, if a new video is uploaded in YouTube, then what action should be taken by the system? Actually, there are, there is one more trigger called as the new comment. However, in case if you don't find the trigger of your choice, you can make a request to our team at admin at the rate for the specific trigger that you want to make. But at present, I am interested in sending the data when a new video is made in the YouTube channel. So let's keep it as new video on the channel. Then click on this blue button called as connect with YouTube. Then in the new credentials, again click on connect with YouTube. Okay, so these are the series of Gmail accounts I have. Aaron Manuel and Michael Karras. So at present, I am interested in the video present in this Gmail account. Now, my Gmail account has two channels, again Aaron Manuel and Dr. Doom. I am interested in this channel. So, Pabli Connect is asking access to this channel. So, I am going to click on allow. Okay, it is showing the authorization is successful. Just click on OK. Now, as you may see, the channel ID is showing as Aaron Manuel. So, it is actually already showing my channel ID. Okay, let me show you my YouTube channel. So this is my YouTube channel and uh, this is the channel ID. So let me show you one more thing. When you toggle right, it will actually show you the real channel ID in the characters. So you may ask, what is this? So let me show you my real channel ID. So let's uh, go to this part called as settings under profile. Click this. Then go to this part called as the advanced settings. Here you will find the option called as the channel ID. Okay. So in case if you want, just copy this, then paste it here. So basically what we have done here is we have asked Pabli Connect 
to connect with this channel okay so this particular channel id so let's click on save and send test request okay so the api response is showing a set of data so let me show you my video that i had uploaded recently so this is my video let me show you okay so the name of the video is uh, bb okay and the visibility is public so public connect has captured the data okay the title is bb and uh, it has been published at this time and this is the width this is the height and this is the url okay so all the data has been captured by public connect because it is now integrated with youtube now we have to sync this data to google sheet so to do that just click on this plus button so when you click on this plus button another window opens up this is called as the action window here in the choose app let's make it as google sheet because we want to sync all the data into google sheets in the choose method let's make it as add new row now add new row is actually an action so there are many more actions like create a spreadsheet delete a sheet copy a sheet update a row and so on but similarly like triggers if you don't find the action of your choice you can request at admin at the rate pably.com to build a custom action for you but at present i am interested in keeping it as add new row so your obvious question is why we are keeping the action as add new row well to explain you that let me show you my google sheet so this is the google sheet i have made for youtube so the these are the rows i have title of video url of video and publish date so as you can see the data will be automatically inserted into adjacent rows one by one for example the title row will be inserted then the youtube url row will be inserted and the date of publish will be inserted okay so just click on connect with google sheet then again in new credentials just click on connect with google sheets now as you can see there are two accounts so i am interested in this account you may ask why i am interested in this account that's answer is very simple because my google sheet youtube to google sheet is present in this account so i am clicking this so it is asking me to confirm my choice just click on allow okay so while it is authorizing let me tell you something pably connect doesn't take any chances with your data your data is 100 percent secure with us okay so it is showing the authorization is successful just click on okay scroll down so in the spreadsheet it is showing screaming frog crawl data that is because there is a spreadsheet called as screaming frog crawl data so we want this spreadsheet youtube to google sheet so let's change it to youtube to google sheets in the sheet it is showing sheet one this is because there is only one sheet called as the sheet one okay so basically it has mapped this detail so in the title of the video we are going to map in the title of the video to do that just click on this button this is called as the mapping button click this and just type title the title is kept bb now comes the url of the video to explain the url of the video let's go to youtube once again so this is the youtube and uh, let's uh, pick one video so the video name is chinese man trips suspect fleeing from police okay so as you can see up to here is basically the youtube url and this part is the video id so i'm just basically copying this this part only and pasting it here and press enter so it again brings us back to youtube but not to this video okay so we need this part so this whole url is comprised of two parts the youtube part and the video id part okay if you get the gist so let's go to youtube and first let's copy this actually i had copied this and paste it up to here okay then we are going to map in the id of the video so id is this id okay video and this random characters so this is the video id okay so the publish date we can map in the publish date then click on save and send test request okay so the api response is showing the data has been entered into google sheet so let's check our google sheet yes all the data has been entered so as you can see the title of the video is bb so let's go and check the url of the video okay so we have got the correct url okay excellent and this is the published date 
okay so the presence of uh, this data shows that we have successfully connected youtube to google sheet with help of public connect so anytime a new video is uploaded in youtube public connect will ensure that that data will be appended into google sheet but to double check it if the integration is working fine or not let us upload one more video in youtube but before that before that before that let me show you the whole gist of the process so i'm minimizing my action window and then i'm minimizing my trigger window okay so this is the whole process in a nutshell first you integrated youtube to pably connect then you integrated pably connect to google sheet so now there is a perfect flow of data between youtube and google sheets okay so let's upload one more video in our youtube channel let's go to create upload video i'm going to upload a random video let's say let's say let's say something random that's coming to my mind i think this is a small video okay so the video is getting uploaded a, the title is ACTU. Okay, so the video called as ACTU, ACTU has been published. So let's see in our Google Sheet whether we have a data related to ACTU. So this is our Google Sheet. Yes, we have a data. So the title of the video is ACTU. And let's see our video link. Let's, uh, yeah. So when we click it, it opens the ACTU video. Okay, excellent. And this is the published date. So this means our integration is working absolutely fine. So whenever a new video is uploaded in YouTube, the data will be reflected in Google Sheets. Not just these two apps, you can integrate a plenty of applications using Pabli Connect. If you have any queries, contact us at admin at the rate Our dedicated team members will help you to automate your workflows. Or just visit us at www.pabli.com. It's awesome. Thanks.